Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make this cool and satisfying effect easy in After Effects. First of all let's duplicate the clip and then rename it to Rotoscoped. Now let's grab a Roto Brush tool and double click on Rotoscoped layer. Make sure to Rotoscope the car as smooth as possible. Once you are done, click on Freeze button. As the freezing is done, close Rotoscoping window and go back to your main composition. Now duplicate Rotoscoped layer and rename it to Effects. Let's apply Fill Effect now. Change the color, I will choose something light blue. Now apply Find Edges effect. Make sure to check Invert and then let's apply Turbulent Displace effect. Under a Turbulent Displace effect, I will set the values randomly. In your case you can play around with the settings until it will look better for you. I will change Amount to 100 and then Complexity to 5. Now hold Alt on your keyboard and click on Evolution Stopwatch icon to open expression down here. Let's type in here, Time, Star icon and 100. This will animate Turbulent Displace effect, let me show you what it looks like. Now let's apply a glow, I will use a deep glow plugin, in case you don't have it, feel free to DM me on Instagram a word, plugins, and then wait for my reply. Finally let's apply Set Matte Effect, but do not change anything yet, just make sure to click on toggle switches slash modes and change effects layers blending mode to add. Now under a set matte effect, change take matte from layer to a rotoscope layer. Now click on source here and change it to effects and masks. And here as you see the effect is applied on a car and it looks really cool. But let's increase the quality of a turbulent displace, make sure to change anti-aliasing for best quality to high. Let's quickly check it now. Looks really satisfying to me, in case you want to change the color, scroll to the fill effect and feel free to change it. If it's not enough for you, you can also make it colorful, just apply 4 color gradient effect on that layer and then make sure to drag that effect above a deep glow plugin. Now make sure to change blending mode to hue and then simply play around with the colors until you will be happy with it and you are ready to go. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.